Welcome to Resident Vania. The name is, I think, self-explanatory. That's a castle right there. Hmm. Getting my sea legs, my spooky courtyard legs, rather. I can break you. Knife. Fun moment. Nice. L for pistol. L? Oh. Hello, good sir. Hello man. Can I knife you? May I stab? May I please stab? I cannot stab, apparently. I'm not allowed, I'm not permitted. The right, to stab and harm. Oh. They're little guys. I think not. I think not. There's the lady her very self, the pillar of tall women everywhere. What can I say? I appreciate her. Oh she's going to kill me. Please don't kill me. Is it too much to ask that you simply do not? Please, do not. Oh. That's gonna be a solid no for me, chief. I request that you cut that out. Oh there's... There's bitey guys up there. Yeah. They're going to murder and kill me. Wait why are you going that way buddy? Buddy. Come here. Come here. Come over here. Hello. Not you guys again please can we chill. Ouch. They're going to murder me. They're going to kill and ruin my life. They're going to destroy me. They're going to kill. My whole me. I simply cannot allow that kind of disgusting behavior, that kind of repulsive action. Can I break the chandelier? I can. I'm so powerful. This is almost embarrassing. But not embarrassing enough to stop me. Pong. I think if I keep running, they won't catch me. Because they are slow. Huzzah. Escope. That is a hole. Oh my god. What the shit. Please. Enough is enough. Please. I'm just a little guy. You're going to murder and kill me. A soup dish for thief. Exuberant. Did I just die? It would seem I did not die. To assume death was to clown. Oh shit that's not something I'm supposed to- Oh. Let me out. Ow. Please, I just want pass. Horrendous. I think enough is enough and to kill me it would be rude and insulting. I need to get my- Dastardly. I've been killed and murdered. Absolutely ruined my life. Killed me, destroyed my- My ambitions, made my life a living hell. I thought that it was some kind of, you just kill them and they die and they stay dead and no more of them appear. But no, that is not how this works. There's no point in killing them if it does not satisfy the completionism in my brain. It does nothing, is it enough, God, to just want to absolutely destroy the light? I don't think it's too much. I really don't. How dare you? Oh, he's just gone. He's gonna keep going. He's not coming back. Oh, gun? I swear to you I have a gun, I swear to you. Oh, I think I have to go back and get it from where I was murdered. But I've got my knife. Just not my gun, I guess. Because that'd be just too kind. 
back into the hole I go. With my cold little soul and my empty pockets, oh my god. Enough is enough and killing me is not something I deserve. Nay, request. Give me back my gun. I just want my gun back. I just want to kill and murder. Please just let me kill on murder, I don't think it's too much to ask. I thought I might get my gun back, but I guess not. I have no gun. No weapon. I'm going to be murdered, cruelly and coldly in my bed, and I was. I just want my weapon of mass destruction. Is that too much to ask? Am I some kind of fool? Well clowns, I don't know if there was a point to that so I'm just going to leave? That was completely rude and unnecessary and uncalled for. I would like some ammo. Exuberant. Okay so I'm back like a clingy ex-boyfriend. I just want my gun back I can't live without it. I guess I lost my gun for good. I guess is it. No more gun for thief. Thief is poor, and does not deserve gun. That's what this game is telling me, it's telling me that I. Oh my god. The game is saying that I do not deserve gun, nay do I need gun. I'm not fighting those bird creatures, it's just not going to happen. No. I have no gun. I would like a gun. I think I deserve a gun. I think I need a gun. Yes, I need a gun. I would like a gun, please. I would like weapons of mass destruction. Um what the hell is that? Yeah, get away from me. Get the hell away. No, we don't do that here. I don't have a. I don't have a gun, dude. You can't do this to a poor gunless little guy. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna exit the game. Because I need my gun, I would like my gun. I would please like to have my gun. Gun. Listen, in general I'm not big on guns. But I just think that I should have one in this place with creatures of various tendencies towards murder. I think that it's necessary. A necessity. I am going to get my baby. Isn't that what this has all been about? My baby child? I'm going to make heads roll. I'm going to kill these ferocious fiends, I'm going to end, all of this ridiculous behavior. Hello, sir. I destroy fire with a knife, I'm ridiculously powerful. Hello woman, she's so... marvelous. Honestly, I, I don't have anything against these fellows. I might have said otherwise before, but now that I've had some time to recollect, and to think on everything, I've come into their domain and I'm just kind of wrecking havoc, I'm taking their fire. I'm stabbing their local dog things, dog humans, werewolf creatures. I'm just wrecking things left and right, all for the sake of a baby. Who does that? I'm sure any human would, any human who's ever been a parent would, you know, I feel like that's normal. But at the same time, I'm in their home. I wouldn't expect them to be chill with it and if they were I'd be a little concerned. So you know what, fair is fair. All's fair in love and war and all's fair in getting the baby. My baby. They did kidnap my baby. I'm pretty sure they kidnapped my baby. So I feel like. On the other hand, I have all right to be here. I have every right to stab them. They took my baby. That's my baby. I am the parent here. I am the one with. I am the one who had to whose baby was taken. I have every right to stab and cause havoc. So actually, I take it back. I don't. I don't. I don't sympathize with them. They should give me back my baby. Good soup. And if they don't give me back my baby. Well, I will wreck havoc. So much havoc that there will be nothing left for them, but ash and pain. Because that's my baby they took. And I don't think I intend to ever be a parent, but if I was well, I wouldn't want my baby taken. Babies you must cherish and care for, not let some wild banshee creature, take away. Honestly, I'm a little insulted that they would even think to take my baby. That's my baby. It's mine. They should never have taken my child, that's just a complete and utter dastardly thing to do and honestly, it's kind of a crime. Kind of an insult. Rude and completely disgusting behavior from them. To be completely honest, they should never have taken my baby. 
It was not theirs to take, it was my baby, they should have asked, they should have asked if they could borrow and hold my baby, and I would have said no, they would have cried, and everything would have been fine, because I would not have killed them. Crying is better than getting killed. I think anyone will tell you that. Anyone with a good sense of smell will tell you that. Anyone who has a brain, anyone with a solid brain on their shoulders, will tell you that. I would like to have some, some crystal skull, I would like it. I would like it a lot. Alright, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Ciao. Have a nice time in your dungeon, in your dirty little dungeon down there. Hello Batwoman, I would like to be left alone, left to my own devices, really, to be frank. It's only fair that I be left to my own devices, I've put up with you guys enough. I've been courteous, I've been. I've been kind, and you have, uh, I may have stabbed a few dozen of you, I may have done that. I'll give you that one. Was it well deserved, though? The answer is yes. Yes it was. You did this to yourself, really. By treating me in such a despicable way. Oh. That was a mistake. Also a mistake. Stop killing me. Please let me live. Please do not kill and crush my bones into a fine powder. That's murder. I don't think I deserve such cruel and heartless treatment. Sometimes, you die. But you live. And that was one of those times. And that's on killing your enemies. Honestly, it's what she deserves. She came out of nowhere and started beating me up. There was no negotiations or prior discussion. There was no why are you in my home, I'm calling the police. There was no, I'm sorry for taking the baby, I didn't take the baby, it was actually my mother, she kidnapped your baby and I had no business in it. I just wanna suck your blood and kill you, don't worry about it. There was none of that. She just attacked. And really, I did, I did break her window and destroyed her home, that is fair. But you know what? Enough is enough. Violence is never the answer, it's the question. And the answer is usually yes. But there has to be a little bit of communication before you commit the violence, or else it's just bloodshed, and honestly, I don't think I'm to blame for this. I don't think I'm to blame. Now where is my baby? Oh that is my head. Hmm. Oh. Hello. Miss ma'am. You. Um. Hello. Thank you for playing. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. You took my head. Fair enough. I respect that. Okay, so this was Resident Vania. It's a mix of Resident Evil and Castlevania. With Resident Evil I know a little bit about the storyline and the gameplay of it but I have not played it mainly because I did not have the processing power on my current computer to even handle that game. But I do know kind of the gist of Resident Evil. So I think this game is Resident Evil in the Castlevania style which I think works really well. It's a very fun game. I wish that I had been able to keep my gun. I would have liked to have kept my gun. But honestly that's not a game problem it's a me problem, because I kept losing it. I have a tendency to lose things and I suppose my gun was no different, so I can't blame the game for that. I blame my own lack of grabby hands, my lack of carcinization. But this game is fun and funky fresh and you can play it on a brick. It's very short, I think that if I wasn't such a clown it would have been a lot shorter to watch. I'll put a link to it in the description if you're interested. I will see you in the next video, where I test the limits of hypothermia by playing hide and seek in a Walmart freezer. Toodles. Don't get hit by a crane.